And you've done so many good indie projects and you're such Thank a great you. actor. And um, I think one of the things is you, you made decisions to pick certain roles and not take other roles. But now looking back, you've said that maybe you would have done things a little, little different because you've had some amazing opportunities. Is there one role that you would like to, if you could go back in time to, to accept that role? Uh, no, I mean, I think I know what you're referring to, but I don't, it's not, uh, you know, there's a, there's a knock on effect from everything you do. And I've had the most, uh, uh, I've, I've been able to work with the most amazing people over the course of my career and I wouldn't change any of it. Uh, but I, I, I am a different person now than I was when I was younger and, and the, the business has changed so dramatically. It's very difficult now to make a living in independent film fully. Uh, we shot this film, uh, Inherit the Viper, for, I mean, you could make a hundred of these films for every studio film that's made. Uh, there, it was a very, very small budget. We shot it very mm -hmm. quickly. Sometimes we only had one take for each setup. Uh, in order uh, to get everything that we needed in order to film, in order to make the film and put it together. And pretty much everything that we shot is actually on the screen and you can see it in the film. There isn't a lot of extra stuff that is lost, uh, even takes. I mean, there's very little shot, very little time. So sometimes, and I love that challenge, but sometimes, you know, when I started my, started making independent film, there was more money in independent film. There was the ability to take, you know, a few weeks, a couple of months even, to make these films uh, and nowadays it becomes more and more a labor of love so I it, it's unfortunate but it's getting harder and harder to make them um, but I will continue to try you know I mean that's that's in my opinion part of the part of the fun of our industry is it's still sometimes like the Wild West you can still push things through that shouldn't have any business being seen by the public and in this and in this instance, I think it's similar in that it's a really great story told well with good people in it, but it really doesn't have a lot of backing on a national uh, on a national scale. And yet it's going to now get a release in theaters, which is, is super exciting for me.